Hi everyone, thanks for popping back over to my channel. Now today I've got my third Z-Box and I can't remember what the theme is this month, but I think Blockbuster seems to ring some memories. Oh, that was it, yeah, Blockbuster with Jaws and E.T. and then I think was some superhero, maybe Spider-Man. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure exactly what to expect in here, but I, fingers crossed, I'm hoping for a Funko. I have become a bit of a Funko addict. I've now got, just counting them, six. They're all Disney ones, um, but I have got a few on the way and wait for them to arrive in the post. So once they arrive, I'll have more Funkos to show you. But first of all, we have the Z-Box. So as I've said before, this is a monthly subscription. It's supposed to be a mystery box designed for geeks and it's from Zavi.com. You can order, um, maybe one or three or six boxes depending on how long you're willing to subscribe up for and depending on how long you subscribe you get a little bit more um, or less money depending on um, which option you go for. So I think I went for the sixth month one and it's 17 99 a month. So as I said this is my third box, I've got three more after this one and then after that I guess I'll decide. Each box you get a t-shirt, you get a limited edition coin, you get some kind of figurine, fingers crossed for Funkos and some other bits and bobs as well so yeah enough talking let's get into this box if i can how the heck do you open this thing ah that's how you open it okay so lots of uh bubble wrap and so First thing I'm pulling out is the t-shirt. The t-shirts probably have been my favourite things that I've received in the Z-Box so far. So first one I got was a Harry Potter one, the second one I got was Back to the Future. Each of those things are like right up on top of the scale of my favourite fandom merchandise. So I am seeing the t-shirt first and I'll pull that out first. Although I do like to say the best things to last, but anyway, I've pulled it out now. It's a black t-shirt and on the front we have E.T. So you can see on the front we've got the moon with the classic um, bike riding across the front with, I can't remember the little boy's name that's in E.T. but him on his bike with E.T. sat in his basket it says E.T. the extraterrestrial down at the bottom. So really pleased with that t-shirt, I think that's a really cool t-shirt actually. I, I mean I, I love E.T. who doesn't love E.T. but I wouldn't say that I would go out of my way to buy E.T. merchandise but you know. Spielberg is great at what he does and I think any kind of 80s um, 80s kind of memorabilia is really um, is really cool and yeah I will definitely be wearing this really pleased with it actually I love the colours on it I think they're really bright they really stand out really happy with this t-shirt so the next thing I'm pulling out do you know I was sure there was Funko in this week's box but there is no Funko in here so I'm very disappointed but what I am seeing is a pint glass it's a Suicide Squad pint glass I haven't seen the movie although I do mean to get round to watching it I know it's been out for ages now and I really really should get round to watching it but I haven't um, I do know some of the characters from the movie already I'll get it out of the box so you can have a look it's a pint glass it says Suicide Squad Try and get it to focus. There we go, that's a bit better. So you can say that it says Suicide Squad and we have some of the characters dotted around on the outside. Um, oops, sitting on bubble wrap. Um, yeah, so um, quite a cool glass. I think I will definitely use this actually. Um, I'm just gutted that I'm not seeing any Funkos in this box to be honest. Like. Yeah, very, very sad about that. I was sure the website said there were Funkos. What I have got is, um, oh, so this is the first time that they've done this. Now, I have always felt that um, there should be some kind of teaser or some kind of um, leaflet explaining what's in the box and what, you know, a bit of a teaser for next month does look like they've managed to uh, put something together for this one. It says Blockbusters. It says 4 99 on here. Now that is definitely not how much I'm paying for the box. And if it should be 4 99 then that's a bargain, one off. And two, I want to know about it because I want to pay 4 99 So yeah, I'm not sure what the 4 99 is all about, but inside here um, 
it talks a little bit about what's going on um nerdy stuff so it's talking about the london comic con it's talking about um what's in the box it's talking about the um the theme so it's talking about blockbusters and and um, so for example it says top five blockbuster aliens um, and it's got a little word search in here as well I'll have a flick through that um, later, but let's find out who the number one alien is. And of course, right on, first on the page is E.T., obviously. Oh, I'm not going to flick any further because um, it does tell me what else is in the box and I don't want to spoil it. But I'm seeing on the back of the box, we have monsters next month. Now, when I think monsters, the thing that I hope for is um, Stranger Things and the Demogorgons? Demo? You know, those big scary things from Stranger Things. So hopefully there's some Stranger Things um, Funkos in there. Now, as with every Z-Box, you get a limited edition coin. And this month's coin is a Jaws one. Um, now, they tend to come in either a silver or a gold edition. Every time I've had one so far, I've had the silver ones. I've not seen what the gold ones are like. Um, they are... As I say, limited edition, but they are exclusive to Z-Box, so you can only get these from the Z-Boxes. And this one is Jaws. So you can see on the front there, we have the Jaws shark. And around the edge, um, we've got some um, teeth. And it says 1374 on the bottom there. I'm guessing that's the number, um, the number of the coin. But then here it says coin 14, so I don't know. I'm confused. Maybe it's number 14. That would seem more... Um, more limited I guess so yeah um, I'm not sure what I think of these coins as I said I've got three now I've got the um, Jurassic Park one the Jaws one and the Hellboy one I'm not sure what to do with them to be honest Avengers so um, I did remember mentioning some Avengers thing in here so we have a keychain a key ring um, but it also says that it's a four-in-one tool so it's Captain um, Captain America's shield and it is also a screwdriver, some scissors, a flathead screwdriver and a bottle opener. So not something I um, will be putting on my keys but I might pass this on to my boyfriend. Um, he's always, you know, he likes to think he's good at DIY and stuff so um, he's a bit of a nerd, a bit of a geek also and yeah so I think I'll pass this on to him couple more things in the box now what is this so these are Avengers Infinity War and they look like they're stickers which is pretty cool gadget decals decals I think they're like adhesives that you can put on and um, what it looks like from the back of here on the front here that you can put them on your phone you can put them on your laptop um, but I'm sure they they stick to pretty much anything looks like there are some really cool designs on the back I think my favorite one i mean i love guardians of the galaxy so any ones um that are guardians of the galaxy are probably my favorites i think i probably like this one down here best so they come on in this um pack and um there are quite a few in here actually so that star lord one's pretty cool as well we have the star lord here and these, these ones are pretty cool as well. I love the design of these. Yeah, I'm quite happy with these. I'm not, um, I'm not an Avengers fan. I do like Guardians of the Galaxy and I did love the Infinity, um, Infinity War movie. So yeah, I'm actually quite pleased with those. And then there's one more thing in the box. Hi, I'm sorry if the camera angle has changed slightly. My battery in my camera died and I've um, just had to switch it over to another one. So there's only one thing left in this box to open anyway and it looks like some kind of movie poster. It does say Harry Potter on there so it looks like definitely there's going to be a Zero Funko delivery in this box which I'm quite disappointed about because I'm sure on the internet when I checked last week it did say that Funko was on there. So that is disappointing, particularly because um, it's one of the main reasons I signed up to this box was because there was a, at least a chance of getting a Funko. Anyway, this is a cool poster. It is a Harry Potter poster. So again, thumbs up already, but it is a Patronus poster. So you can see on there, we've got the stag from Harry's Patronus. 
and it's got like a um, geometric design around the stag and down at the bottom it says Expectro Patronum and it's got I guess that's Harry's wand down at the bottom there casting the spell if I can show you a bit closer oh right let me open this up a little bit better so it's not flapping around and that you can actually get a good view let me just do this there we go that's a little better so yeah really cool poster really happy with that actually um would look pretty cool in a frame wouldn't it it's very um like halloweeny with october just around the corner it's great to receive this and also, I um, received tickets to the Harry Potter world for my birthday, so can't wait. Um, London, although I'm in the UK, London is quite a trek, but yeah, really excited to get to that. So that's everything in this month's Z-Box. Thoughts on this box are that I'm loving the t-shirt most of all. I'm extremely disappointed. I know I keep saying I'm disappointed about the Funkos, but I am really disappointed about the Funkos. I'm excited about next month's theme being monsters and we have three more left of these z-box to go before i decide if i'm going to continue them or not but that's all i've got for you today and again thanks for popping over to my channel and i'll see you guys again soon bye <laughs>